so here is question first of exercise 7.1 the very first question of this chapter that is in quadrilateral abcd here the quadrilateral is abcd ac is equal to ad this side is equal to this side ab bisects angle a what does this mean ab this line is bisecting the complete angle a it means bisecting means it is dividing the complete angle into two equal parts it means you can say let this angle is 1 and this angle is 2 so angle 1 is equal to angle 2 show that triangle abc triangle abc is congruent to triangle abd you have to show these two triangles are congruent and what can you say about bc and bd bc and bd is there any relation between these two sides or not that you also have to show or you also have to tell now first in triangle abc and triangle abd because i have to show these two triangles are congruent so in triangle abc and abd first of all i will write what the given conditions are the given information is ac is equal to ad angle cab is equal to angle dab and see very carefully you have four rules sas asa aas and sss now see given is first side this is the side and this is the angle so we have one side and one angle so i can apply either this condition if i have one more side that is given to be equal i can apply this condition also if i have one angle more that is given i can apply this condition or not side is given and one angle is given if one more angle is given that is equal then i can apply this condition but i cannot apply this rule because in this rule i need all of the three sides must be equal now see these two triangles that i have to show that these two triangles are congruent this is given equal to be this this is equal to this see very carefully ab is the side that is common in this triangle also and in this triangle also ab is the common side for both of the triangles and ab is equal to ab it will also always show 2 is equal to 2 5 is equal to 5 7 is equal to 7 it will it is a true fit so i can write ab is equal to ab ab is the side of this triangle ab is the side of this triangle also reason is common side and these two statements are given now see side angle side side angle side in this triangle see also side angle side between two sides i have included angle between two sides i have included angle so the rule will be applied side angle side therefore you can write triangle abc is congruent to triangle abd and reason is by sas congruency rule very good now the next part is what can you say about bc and bd bc is the third side of triangle abc and bd is the third side of triangle abd and you know very well if two triangles are congruent then all of the six corresponding parts that is three angles and three sides will be equal and by this rule we can say bc is equal to bd and the reason will be by cpct cpct means 
corresponding parts of congruent triangle are equal. So this was all about question number first. First you will take these two triangles, write the given condition, write which is common part, see from the given four rules which rule can be applied most suitably and then you can prove the results.